Hello, it's Becca and welcome to the Carriage House, a little place to find comfort and cozy inspiration for your hearth and home. I'm in our kitchen this afternoon at our little farmhouse on the northern plains of Iowa. I have fruits to dehydrate so they won't go to waste, a bag of tea waiting to be brewed, a cozy dinner will be simmering on the stove, and I'll also be doing a little bit of self-care in between. So as always, I'm really glad you're here with me and looking forward to spending time with you here at my home, the Carriage House. my lemons and limes in salty water for about 15 minutes and I do this just to help preserve the color of the lemons and limes during the dehydration process but I poured myself a nice glass of ice water and used a few of the remaining citrus pieces to add to my water just for an extra metabolism boost and plus I just simply love the smell and essence of lime but apart from getting a good night's rest Staying hydrated and sipping on ice water throughout the entire day is the absolute most important thing that I do every day, especially since I have four children to educate at home and a home to take care of, just like a lot of you do. And if I don't do this, I become very lethargic and just plain tired. Plus the hydration is wonderful for your skin and body as a whole. So I just wanted to share this tiny but mighty tip that I do daily to take care of myself at home.
this Indian curry dish are beginning to fill the air. So many of these Indian spices are very beneficial to your health. Turmeric for glowing skin, coriander for lowering blood pressure, ginger for relieving nausea and depression. Our world is an apothecary. You just have to dive a little deeper to find these mystical remedies and beauty in the mundane. Good job. 